Once again, we're back with a beautiful sight to see. Been a long time since I've been here. Let's go ahead and chill out. I brought the wrong shoes to the sand, but that's why we clean them. Got a lot of sand to walk past, you feel me? On the way over here to talk about something in the bag and just chop it up for a bit, bruh. I really don't like this, but it is what it is, man. They're shoes, you just clean them. Whole lot of amazingness. Not many people out here. Some, but not too many. We going right over here to where we used to go. Have you guys been a part of this channel since like 2018, I think it was? Maybe early 2019. I would come up here, talk about shoes, talk about the views, and just chill out, man. Yes, yes, yes. You got to take advantage when this is in your backyard, bro. Backyard. Backyard boogie, right? Not too far at all from the crib. What's poppin' YouTube? Your boy Bosco back again with another video. Hopefully you're having a great day wherever you are in the universe. We're here at the beach right now, man. About to switch it up just a tad bit. Check out some shoes. Talk about them for a second. We got a full day ahead of us, bro. Hopefully you guys do come for the ride. I'm here at the beach right now. Doc Waller about to head to Culver City Fox Hills Mall. Just see what they got in store. It won't be too long. But if you guys see something you like, you got to say something. Watch it all the way to the end if you haven't already done so. And make sure you subscribe with the notification bells. And those of you guys who want to cop these sneakers, bro, hit that join button to get them at the best price you guys possibly can. Without further ado, let's get into the video, you dig? I'm about to go through these stores. We got Foot Locker, uh, Chic, Champs, and maybe JD Sports now. So the first store we're headed to, I guess, is JD Sports. We're going to see what's in there. Here's the thing, this is why you need to follow me on Instagram. Because by the time this video is posted, the shoes you see, if you wanted it, it might be gone by then. So follow me on IG only helps you get the shoes or the images of what's in the store at real time. Follow me on Bosco, Bosco's Goodies on IG. So they have a really good selection of Jordan Mids here, the lasers. I'm not sure what this colorway is called, but it got patent leather. Then you got these ones, which are pretty dope white ones you got these but only a size eight and a half small sizes in those as well pretty good jordan selection these are dope at some point these will jump into my collection are you guys a fan of these or not i don't really see too much of a response once i do post these i think they're fire very classic shoe let me know what you guys think another jd sports exclusive colorway which is pretty dope for the air max 90 let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below 120 on the retail so that's not bad not typical 130 these are pretty dope, man. Let me know if you guys are liking them or not. I'm about to lose my shit right now. They got two fire shoes. I've never seen this before ever in my life. What shoe is this, bro? Going crazy. This Kyrie 6 is dope. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. And they have a new colorway of the Kyrie Low 3. Which I have yet to see. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. These are pretty fire. Never seen this Kyrie 6 colorway. If you guys have before, is this an early release or something? It's not a, it's not an ID because it's here for retail. Same thing with this Kyrie Low 3. This is ridiculous, bro. Another JD Sports exclusive colorway, which is pretty dope for the Air Max 90. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. 120 on the retail, so that's not bad. Not typical 130. These are pretty dope, man. Let me know if you guys are liking them or not. Finally, at last, we get these things in hand, bro. We're we going to get these home, one one pair of these, definitely, and uh, do a full review. Let me know what you guys think of LeBron 17, or LeBron 18, excuse me. Let me know what you guys think about the LeBron 18s. Are you guys liking the other colorways? You guys like this one? I think this one is pretty dope, bro. Can't wait to do a review on one of these shoes. It looks pretty fire, though. What are you guys rated from a 1 to 10? They even have the Adapt BBs and the tie-dye colorway, which is pretty dope, bro. I'm not going to lie, majority white. Just the price point is not something I'm rocking with. But they got these on deck, too. So here for the grade school sizes, they got these Jordan 5s, which I'm not sure when they actually came out. They're not too bad. 140 on the retail for the ladies or grade school. I think this is women's. 
Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. Clearness on the outside. These are pretty dope. Quality looks pretty far. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. 140. We got the toddlers hooked up. All toddler sizes. Look at those, bro. Toddler sizes only, unfortunately. Pretty far, though. <laughs> Go, we're about to go around, plus there's so much copyrighted music. And we got other stores to check out, so we're about to go there and check it out now. For the kids, they got some of these on deck. The Celtic 10s, these are, whoa, catching the heat. These are dope, usually 140, they don't sell for 109. They got these on deck, this is a size nine and a half, but I think they got some other sizes too. Very clean Celtic. They got like Celtic 10, Celtic 13s, what's up with this, man? This sneaker setup here is pretty fire, bro. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comment section below. The years he won the ring in, right? Six, seven, and eight. 10, or 11, 12, and 13. Or 14. You guys can see they have a pretty good selection of some stuff and a lot of things that are on sale with tags. The bronze 17s. James Gang. Don't really remember these, but these are pretty cool though, man. 150, but now 60 bucks. Pretty clean for these boots. Or oh, these Adidas. Let me know what you guys think about them in the comment section below and if you guys would cop these or not. Pretty dope. So if you're enjoying the video, make sure you guys hit the like button before you leave. Leave comments about anything you guys see and uh, just share that good energy, bro. Without further ado, let's get back to the video, you dig? So this is the back of the Foot Locker here in. Culver City, which is dope. You see, they got some things on sale. You got red tags, 79 bucks, 55s. Okay, 79 bucks on there. They got a couple pair of those. Let me know what you guys are thinking about these, man. We're gonna take some posts and put it up there. This one always had a pretty good selection of stuff. You know what I mean? Kyrie, Nike basketball selection, of course. Only thing that we're seeing here that we don't see at most places is the Kyrie 6 Asia. Super dope to see that they had this here. Very, very dope shoe. At some point I will get it. Why is it not on sale yet? I don't know. But it is fire. Maybe that's why they're gonna hold off because the people are buying this. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. They got a bunch of tailwinds on deck too. This colorway is not bad. The black colorway 3M is popping. 160 normally. Now it's only 49 bucks, but that's pretty dope. These ones here, we're sorry, eight. This is size 11, so they got this for 89 bucks. Normally 185, bro. That's fire. That's a nice deal, too. Something chic, and look what I came across, bro. The Jordan Olympic jerseys. Look at the package right there. Fire, bro. This thing is ridiculous. As I'm mounted around the mall, I got hit up for a shoe. Now I'm going back to Foot Locker. Is that a line all of a sudden? Let's go ahead and over there and see. I got to pick this shoe up. Hopefully, I can get inside the store. Damn. Never seen this Kyrie shirt. This is far. This actually kind of goes with my shoes. And they got it in a black colorway too. I don't see no price tag on it. And they're size small, so that's one reason why I can't get them. Oh, this is dope, though. So we're about to go pick up some Jordan Mids for a subscriber. I'm super dope. Soon she will be a member, but like I said, everybody can just go ahead and try it out at least once to see if they really like it see how I go, then go ahead and join and become a member. I'm telling you, it's beneficial, no limits. We're just grinding, bro. Hi, it's the Jordan 1 Mid. It's uh, size 11. Yeah, I think it's Daniel. Yep, yep. So they're on the way to you. I'm paying for them now, and then I'm gonna ship them off. Once again, I really appreciate your support. Let's go. Let yet another happy person you dig. I have yet to see this colorway for the Vapor Max 360. It's pretty dope, man. Retail is 225. That's not so dope. But let me know what you guys think about this colorway, man. This is actually pretty fire. Have not seen this colorway before. Normally 160, they got them for 129. What do you think? They got them here for 60 bucks also, which is dope. Normally 130, but they got them for 60. This is not a bad situation right here. What do y'all think about these Kyrie's? 
These other ones are 89 for 60 bucks. Did we see that at the last one? Now look at these, bro. They got two fire colorways. We talked about this one before at the last finish line. I feel like this is like slept on, but maybe people might jump on it later. The quality on it looks pretty good though. I mean, the colorway is really popping though to me. 90 bucks on these. And then what about these? <laughs> these are like those fake Japans. 100 on these. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? Will these sell? 100. I feel like this might be a little, little, a little surprise right there because I haven't really seen that nowhere else. Like, we went around a lot of different places, so I don't know when that actually drops. Let me know. And so you guys are in the store in the mall. You know, hopefully we've been finding some good stuff. I'm pretty sure we are since the mall's just recently opened. But I just want to take the time to thank you guys for all the support and energy you guys have been giving me throughout the whole. YouTube grind, no matter how long I've been doing it for. Uh, shout out to all the new subscribers. Shout out to all the members. We got the Energy Squad. We got 810 Squad. We got the Sneakerhead Squad in the game. Shout out to all you guys. We're only going to go and do more, bro. Hopefully, you guys can just stay tuned for what's to happen. You know, follow me on IG, Bosco's Goodies, as I always tell you guys. Hopefully, these headphones are helping you guys be able to hear me a little better. Uh, because, you know, the waves is crazy. I wanted to come out here by the waves. But that makes a un, you know a noise that I can't even control. But yeah, man, uh, I just wanted to say that, man. I'll see you guys later. We about to get back into the stores. Let's go. So they have these on deck. I know this is a size 10 and a half. Dope to see this one in person. I found a couple pair at uh, Shoe Palace. Now I'm seeing him at Foot Locker. I'm not sure if you guys are feeling them like that, though. I think they are pretty dope. You know, quality is not too bad on these. Shoes is dope, man. 90 bucks only. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? I don't think I've seen them 89 before. I think they were 99, so that's pretty dope. Now $89 as opposed to 150. Let me know what you guys think about these. The bread colorway is pretty dope, man. PG's in the back. $50 only for them right now, bro. 64 for the ACG colorway. A lot of people's favorite LeBron 17 James gang here for 99 bucks. Breads are 129. That's pretty dope. You gotta find that quickly though, you know what I'm saying? That one goes pretty fast. All over. Uh, what do you guys think about these? Only $85. Jordan Low SE Special Edition, so I don't know. Got like a little suede on this area. The whole shoe is like suede material. There's no leather on this. What do you guys think about these in the comment section below? Might be picking these up for a uh, subscriber. These are fire, bro. The employee of the month. Zoom freaks, bro. Crazy. I like I like coming to this finish line inside the Macy's inside the Summer Oaks Mall because they always tend to have shoes that other stores just don't have or colorways. Like this is a Kyrie Flytrap 3, the JBY, Just Be You colorway. Never really seen it before. Maybe seen images online. First time actually getting a chance to see this in person. So that's fire. Let me know what you guys think about these in the comment section below. $65. Here's another colorway of the uh, Donovan Mitchell Issue 2s. This colorway is better than some of the ones we've been seeing. But I haven't seen this in any other store. That's what I'm trying to say. Let me know what you guys think about these, though. These look pretty fire. Like some Nike. They're not ACGs, but the colorway looks like an ACG boot. Let me know what you guys think about these. Only uh, $100. Have yet to see this colorway to Ultra Boost 20. 180 on the retail. This is actually pretty fire. Let me know if you guys are feeling those. And then we've seen this one, but in a different colorway. And this colorway is dope. Sometimes it takes a colorway to make the whole shoe. Got some good cushioning on the midsole. Medial side looks pretty dope. Also, I'm not mad at this shoe. From a one to 10, the colorway gives this shoe like a solid eight and a half, nine, but overall the shoe might be like a seven. Okay, so uh, we back here at the beach again, like I said. We got the Amarillo Air Ups on deck. Uh, we're going to talk about what's in these boxes. I got two shoes here to talk about. Uh, we're going to talk about them here on the channel out here in the beach. I'm not going to do the review at the crib unless otherwise necessary. But uh, we got the Air More Uptempo, uh, size 11 and a half. 
retail 160 on these these things are so classic bro let's go with the classics first or the old or i don't know i don't know first we're just gonna go with this we're not gonna stay long on either one of these things you feel me air jordan mid let me go ahead and take the mid out okay yeah so we're gonna go with these first these jordans these were a very dope cop i picked these up at jd sports in um northridge man was fortunate enough to cop these size 12 not my size but we're just gonna take a quick glance at them i mean that's a glance right there these are fire the cool gray or whatever you want to call these the gray jordan one mids are super fire bro i need to know your honest thoughts and opinions i know there's background noise with the waves but just enjoy the vibes bro these are definitely clean the leather quality on these mids are looking pretty dope and it's very interesting to see how people are going so crazy over mids nowadays maybe it's the colorways they've been dropping maybe it's the leather quality has been upgraded let me know if you guys feel like that's the case what do you guys feel is the real reason why people are going crazy for these jordan mids so many different colorways uh gray school sizes are going even crazier than adult sizes right now which is really different the times are definitely changing definitely changing in a sense you know what i'm saying some people can get off the bigger sizes some people can't it really just depends on what you do in your market i really don't have a problem with my 11s 12s and 13s you know what i'm saying there's a market for everybody i mean i'm a size 13 so i would be kind of a hypocrite to not sell size 13s right but these are 12s we got some members that are size 12s we got uh people who watch who are 12 so these are pretty dope bro might hold on to these for a little bit unless one of the members want them but uh other than that i might just hold on to them for the resale they are pretty dope the resale is pretty good now and it might go up give me your resale predictions in the comment section below closest thing to a dior that would be out there you know what i mean but this shoe is definitely dope uh if i had to give it a rating i would honestly give it a 10 out of 10 i mean it is majority white but the color combination the color blocking is pretty dope and it does remind me of some other classic jordans out there on the market quality on here looks pretty dope man give me your comments in the comment section bro no on feet size 12 pluses for resale so i'm not going to try these on but they are definitely clean all the way around the board just like any other typical jordan one mid if you guys have cops from jordan one mids recently let me know in the comment section which ones you guys have picked up so we're gonna go ahead and sit that down here for a second put that back in the box let that chill then we're gonna go to the classic bro the classic one the classic one bro This one's here so classic, they don't even have a release date for these things. They just now added them to StockX. I don't know if they're on GOAT, but the 2020 edition hadn't been up on the websites, which is crazy. But they're going to start flooding the blocks more as more stars start to get them. But no set release date on these. I think this is supposed to come out in 2020 of this year. But if you're watching my videos, you've been seeing I've been finding these bad boys. Fire. Some people have asked questions a little bit too late when i'm not by the store no more or either your size has been gone because soon as they come out the box bro as soon as they whoop them out put them on the shelves these things are out of here i need to know what you guys think are these things out of here or are they trash overrated or what one to ten score very classic i know so many people who love these shoes when i post them on ig people are going nuts for them bro this is the classic colorway this is one of the three colorways of the shoe i really like there were a few colorways that came out there bro uh this colorway the white with the black you know, all white with the black writing with the pip on the back. And then the uh, USA colorways, the uh, navy blue and whites are my favorite three, top three colorways of the air more up tempos, the 96s. I can't say enough about these shoes. Classic Pippin, perfect for the whole little, you know, Jordan documentary. These were classic in that shoe, I mean, in that, in that documentary. This, this is one of the years they won them rings, bro. This might have been the year of the last dance, if I'm not mistaken. These are pretty ill though, bro. Give me your thoughts and opinions on both of these sneakers. And if you had a choice, man, if you had an option to pick up one of these for yourself, which one would you pick up? Which one would you keep and which one would you flip? There's no, there's no, well, maybe there's a drip, flip, or skip. Maybe somebody would skip these out here, but all, both of these are pretty dope to me. Either one of them is dope for personal or reselling. You cannot go wrong with it, bro. Let me know your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below. As we posted up here by the beach, bro, I've been waiting to be able to bring this type of stuff to you guys for the longest, man. Couldn't do it during the summertime, really. We was quarantining. And early in the year, just really didn't work out for me. But now we here, bro. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this part of the video. This might be a drop off to some, but I just wanted to show you guys really quick what I did cop when I went to see the uh, Ross out here by the LAX airport. These are pretty different, bro. The colorway is really vibrant. Uh, the Adidas Pro Bouncer. Bounce, Adidas Bounce. Uh, these were 40 bucks. The comps are like over 100. 
So we definitely had to scoop these. Uh, let me know if this is something you guys would have scooped too. If you guys want to see more details about these, you guys check, you know, pay attention to the Bobby Thrift channel, you dig? But uh, not too bad selection of shoes right here. 3M on it. I don't know if you guys can really see it because the sun's about to come out. Like Gunner, sun came out. When they got a drop top. But yeah, so uh, we're about to wrap these up here. Chill out and out for a minute. Enjoy this ambiance of the waves before we go hit the uh, the stores like Wildfire and see what's going on. Definitely recommend you guys follow me on IG. Definitely recommend you guys join the channel membership to get merch. Not just shoes, but the clothes and things I see, bruh. You feel me? You might not be able to get what I'm seeing out here in California in your area. So go ahead and take advantage of that. I don't mean to harp on it, but the people who've been down, they've been rocking, bro. And they've been happy. If you have, if you don't know for yourself, go ahead and ask them. And uh, get back to the waves. 